Alright, and not much time before my outfit of the day, but I'm wearing my Buckers and Badasses uh, t-shirt from Borderlands, and I'm pretty hyped about that. Um, it is 7.30. We are meeting super early so that we can get breakfast this morning before the exhibitor hall opens up because uh, we want to watch that. And I'm going to try and see if we can sneak a peek at the card hollow thing first too. Um, breakfast is probably going to be the steak and cheese. Andy. I'm Andy. This is the con that he works at for. The girl con's pretty cool. You should check it out. It's, it's really good. It's Seattle. So, uh, let's compare this hallway to what it was like three days ago when I was the only human being that existed. Carcala. <laughs> so, they're trying to break the record this year, I believe. Their record was a 70, 17 foot tall tower. This year, I think they're trying to go for 18. So uh, hopefully they'll be able to make it, and uh, we will come in on Saturday and watch them uh, tear this thing down. First Gen Con, people! First Gen Con. Yeah. Who are you? I'm Gavin. What? My name's Elysio. Whoa, cool! Yes. Where are you from, Elysio? Come I'm back here. I'm from Florida. I drove from Florida here. How long did that take? Um, four to, well, it took us two days, but this is Shulay. Hi. It's my Jason. Hi. This is Jason. This is Nelly. Hi. Hi guys. Oh, yeah, hi. you're all on YouTube now. You're all famous. <laughs> I, I get 50 views. Yeah. <laughs> well, I was one of the views. Is this all your yeah. same time? Yeah. Yeah. All yeah. 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 Awesome. Mine too. Yeah. 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 That's the best spot for viewing. We go up here every oh, year. Yeah. See? Do you see how far down that crowd stretch is over there? Yeah, that is insane. It's insane. Yeah. Well, welcome. Yes. Thank you. We're going to try. Matt, what are you cosplaying? Lex Luthor. Lex Luthor. Escape from prison with his kryptonite. Hey, what's in your box? Kryptonite. the running of the nerds uh, for everybody to come into the hall and we're now gradually just working our way through it we are on aisle 1100 out of like 2400 so we are getting close to halfway through I guess uh, we have a game in about an hour so uh, we're just gonna kind of keep wandering around here until our game starts we found Darren out of the booth, working way too hard as usual. Okay, okay, we can all agree that I have won Gen Con. I have won Gen Con. So, check these out. Ah, 
Okay, they were 15 bucks. I, I was like, oh, do I want them? Do I don't? Do I not? But they were $15. Like, who's gonna say no to that? Um, we, I'm just quickly back in the hotel room to take a really quick vlog. Um, we went through the exhibitor hall. It was awesome. We got all the way to 1400s, which the hall goes to 3000, so I don't know when we're gonna find more time to do that, but we will. And uh, we are about to go to our next game, or first game actually. It is Ryutama, and Ryutama is a beautiful game that is uh, uh, inspired by like beautiful like Ghibli style anime, I guess. Um, the game is not about conflict, it's not about like fighting monsters, not for the most part. Most of the game is about helping each other, uh, overcoming some obstacles, um, discovering the world, creating the world that you're in. It is absolutely beautiful. I highly recommend it. I've only played this game one other time, um, but I really hope the GM is good and that me and Gav can have a really fun time with this. Game. flat prairie region with mountains in the distance. Mudflats doesn't know where their milk comes from, but every morning the milk is delivered by the local deity, the milkman. Everyone's vegetarian, I guess? <laughs> Legend says the Milky White Mountain is where the milkman lives. Every year a priest is elected to sojourn there to learn. There's an occasional pilgrimage, pilgrimage stop for people of the town also. People. How was the game? It was great. Good fun. What did you like? Like, Why did you like it? Um, it's very different from D&D, &D, what I usually play. Uh, it was interesting seeing a different system. Very cooperative, storytelling kind of idea. Uh, it was great fun, not too serious, which I really enjoyed. Yeah, it was just great. And meeting totally different people, strangers, uh, hanging out, having fun. We're all in the same area for the same thing, so it was cool, not awkward. Where are you going next? <laughs> we are going to Contessa to do my um, game, which is going to be at uh, not 6 to 6 to 10. That's six me. To what are you running? I'm running um, 17. Sweet. By John Wick, and it's going to be pretty cool. It's so exciting. Contessa. Purple sisters! <laughs> wow, look at us. We're, we're a purple pastel rainbow. Beautiful. <laughs> So I've been following her for four years, and every year I say I'm gonna meet her. Well, here she is, the elusive, She's most real. elusive Pokemon in the world. And the rarest Pokemon. She don't, is. Don't catch me. <laughs> don't, don't, catch <laughs> don't throw me. Pokeballs at her. She doesn't like that. I don't like that. I'm at that stage of Gen Con where I try and vlog when I can, and it's usually in a crowd like right now. Um, but it's usually so busy that. Uh, I don't, it's not that I forget, but I try and vlog and I, I'm thinking about so many things because the con is so busy that I'm not really sure I'm making any sense and the only time I will find out is tonight when I actually start to edit this stuff and I'm like, well, this doesn't make any sense, but I'm going to try my best. Look at that Harley Quinn though, yeah, wow. Um, <laughs> right now, I'm heading to my event, by my Lonesome. It is a miniatures event and it is modeling green stuff for beginners. Um, this is going to be like adding hair to a miniature or adding a different weapon or modifying it in some way using this clay type stuff called green stuff and I am real bad at it. And we have found the life size robo rally at the convention center. How cool is that? Uh, you should 100% totally totally try this out if you can make it. It's really cool, especially if you love Robo Rally. Look at all these people playing pickup games in the halls and so happy, so happy. Line 
going to see burlesque show. will be my 24th. I have been coming since 1992. Awesome. You yes. should have a vlog. <laughs> I've been working on it actually. You've been my inspiration. What? Yeah. I am uh, Heather Ashcraft. I am part of Pick Up and Go Games. My husband and I started this a few years ago. We run LARPs. We have a D20 system compressed down to 30 pages. We have our, our non, this is it, modular non-collectible card game. So we are doing demos. We are at pickupandgogames.com. Yeah, everything's on there. We also run LARPs a few times a year. And this is my 24th Gen Con. I've been coming since 92 when we had the original Mecca Center before cell phones, when we still had to find each other in the message boards. Now we have, with the cell phones, we can actually find everybody. And it's been really good. Uh, what is your favorite thing about Gen Con? The people, the atmosphere. I mean, this is like every year, this is coming home. This, I'm coming home in to this your case. Family. Yes, right. my tribe. This is my tribe. Hello, tribe. Hello. <laughs> this is a small portion, and I want to send a quick shout out to my lovely husband. Today, exactly today, is our 10th wedding anniversary. Congratulations! So, clap, 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 clap. Happy, Happy anniversary! anniversary. Well, thank you. Thanks for saying hi. I love him. Glad to do it. <laughs> 